Now I'd like to show you how you can apply a geometric correction to the image pixels themselves based on the results of a previous grid calibration step. Normally the grid calibration coefficients are only invoked as needed for specific requested measurements. However, at times image correction is useful because these coefficients are actually used to transform every single pixel in the image into this corrected format that you see here. Now as we zoom in on some of the details, you'll notice for interpolation type that zero order kind of leaves some rough edges. Bilinear, although a more costly way of doing the interpolation, gives you a smoother result. So you can decide how much you need there. The replacement value is what uh, gets filled in anywhere that a uh, image pixel is not available. So again, the original image is essentially being warped onto this new corrected grid, and you can choose the replacement value, and zero is typical for that. Again, just to illustrate what's happening here, if we go back to the grid calibration step, the original image is still there, so we've got a little bit of distortion and rotation happening here. The corrected image, now we see all of these grid holes line up nicely along our pixel rows and columns.